Uncover the untold story of John Milton, a philosopher ahead of his time. Many of us have heard of John Milton, the renowned poet and author of Paradise Lost. But did you know that Milton was also a profound philosopher whose ideas were far ahead of his time? James Harrington, a contemporary of Milton, might be overshadowed by his more famous counterpart, but their intellectual exchange offers us a glimpse into the philosophical debates of the 17th century. Milton, a man of extraordinary intellect and revolutionary thoughts, believed in the power of reason and the pursuit of truth. He championed the concept of individual liberty and vehemently opposed any form of tyranny or oppression. Sound familiar? It's no wonder that his ideas resonated deeply during a time of political turbulence and societal unrest. One of Milton's most famous quotes reveals his unwavering commitment to the freedom of speech, give me the liberty to know, to utter, and to argue freely according to conscience, above all liberties. In an era where censorship was rampant, Milton's words were a clarion call to challenge the status quo and fight for the rights of every individual. But what sparked Milton's interest in philosophy? Life experiences played a crucial role in shaping his ideas. At the tender age of 33, Milton completely lost his sight, plunging him into darkness. This adversity became the catalyst for his deep introspection and exploration of profound philosophical questions. Blindness became the backdrop against which he contemplated the nature of God, the existence of evil, and the fragility of human life. Milton's epic poem Paradise Lost is a testament to his philosophical musings. In this masterpiece, he delves into the battle between good and evil, the fallibility of human nature, and the boundaries of free will. Through the character of Satan, Milton challenges conventional notions of morality and highlights the complexities of human desires and motivations. His encounters with James Harrington, a political theorist, were no less thought-provoking. Harrington believed in the concept of a commonwealth, where power should be equally distributed among citizens. This idea contradicted Milton's belief in a republican form of government, where individuals had the freedom to express their ideas and participate in the decision-making process. Their debates were intense, but they often found common ground in their shared disdain for authoritarian rule. Harrington's words, the power is in the people, echoed Milton's convictions that true governance should be grounded in the consent and will of the governed. As we reflect on the remarkable philosophical exchange between Milton and Harrington, we are reminded of the timeless relevance of their ideas. Their intellectual discourse challenged the established norms and paved the way for theories that would later lay the foundation for modern democracies. In the world we live in today, with increasing polarization and threats to freedom of thought, Milton's philosophy speaks to us with renewed urgency. His belief in the power of reason, tolerance, and the pursuit of truth serves as a guiding beacon for those seeking to challenge injustice and shape a more equitable society. So, the next time you hear the name John Milton, remember that he was not only a genius wordsmith but also an influential philosopher whose ideas continue to inspire and provoke. Open your mind to the profound wisdom of this visionary thinker, and be prepared to question everything you thought you knew.